Mathematics is a fun and logical subject. I will show you how. Do you know why 2 into 2 is called 2 squared? This is because for a square shape with a length of 2, 2 into 2 gives the area of the square. The same is true for 3 squared, 4 squared, and all other numbers, even x squared. Now, we also know that if we multiply the area of a square with the length again, we get the volume of a cube. Therefore, the volume of this cube is x cubed. This means that three measures of the same length are multiplied. Just like the square, this is possible for any number, 2 cubed, 3 cubed, 4 cubed, and so on. Therefore, the cube of a number is that number being multiplied by itself once and then again like this. This means that that number will have a power of 3 as shown. To calculate the cube of a number, we multiply that number by itself two times to get an exponent or power of 3. 2 cubed is 2 into 2 into 2, which is equal to 8. 3 cubed is 3 into 3 into 3, which is equal to 27. 4 cubed is 4 into 4 into 4. Can you tell what that is equal to? To make the calculation of cubes easier, we first multiply the number by itself. 4 into 4 is 16. And then we multiply the number again. 16 into 4 is equal to 64. All these numbers are called perfect cubes. Perfect cubes are numbers which are cubes of whole numbers. As you can see here, 8 is a perfect cube. It is a cube of 2, which is a whole number. 27 is also a perfect cube. It is a cube of 3. Is 64 a perfect cube? What is it a cube of? Let's do an exercise. From the following examples, identify which of the following are perfect cubes. 125 is a perfect cube as it is equal to 5 multiplied to itself twice, or 5 cubed. 512 is also a perfect cube as it is equal to 8 multiplied by itself twice, or 8 cubed. 18 is not a perfect cube as it is not 3 cubed, rather it is 3 into 3 into 2. 16 is a perfect square and not a perfect cube as it is 4 times 4, which is 4 squared. Let's summarize. The cube of a number is the product of that number by itself twice, like this. Multiplied once to get the square of that number and multiplied again to get the cube of that number. It is important to note that cubes have a power of 3. Perfect cubes are numbers which are cubes of a whole number. For example, 64 is a cube of 4 as 4 raised to the power 3 is 64.